No, I talked about the um, importance of English for um, engineers, mm -hmm. but uh, even for um, just normal people. Um, <clears throat> we want to communicate, uh, we want to introduce um, what we are doing and also our culture to foreign people. So at that time, we do need um, English and also eventually maybe um, we may have to talk to aliens. <laughs> 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 Probably English will be the tool um, at that time as well. The best way is probably studying abroad. If they have experience, they will understand uh, why English is necessary. Mm. Uh, they will uh, start uh, learning English more aggressively. That, that will be the mm. um, motivation I for see. student. The motivation will be the most important. Mm. To live in the US, uh, sometimes I got sick, uh, I have to see doctors. I had to explain um, the status of my headache mm -hmm. or my stomach ache. Right. ache. So English is important communication too. Mm -hmm. doesn't have to be the US. Uh, right, in, yeah, it can be any Asian countries mm -hmm. as well. Since we have uh, good English instructors here, they can make the best use of uh, this opportunity. I s would suggest uh, going to language development center as well as hub. Mm -hmm. They can talk. Mm -hmm. And also they have opportunity to talk to um, foreign students. Currently, probably um, 180 uh, mm -hmm. foreign students here many much more people um, here than when I was student companies need a sort of scale mm. it's a sort of index uh, you can mm. tell the degree of uh, English skill uh, mm. by using TOEIC score I study TOEIC because um, 600 in TOEIC score was uh, one of the conditions mm -hmm. of uh, promotion. That's why I spent a lot of time um, in studying uh, TOEIC tests mm -hmm. for entrance hiring uh, process. Yes, TOEIC might be man mandatory. Uh, since I'm not an um, English teacher, I may be wrong, but um, when I thought my English skills were improved, um, I studied pronunciation mm -hmm. um, of English. Um, you cannot understand what you cannot pronounce. You cannot listen what you cannot pronounce. At that time, I couldn't tell the difference between R, R sound, R sound and L sound. But I, I learned a lot how to tell the difference. After learning that way, so I thought I could, I, I could speak English much better than uh, before. Mm, right. So that's my suggestion. Uh, as I said, since you know we have uh, excellent um, English instructors you can talk to you can mimic uh, how to pronounce from uh, excellent professors teachers